What's up guys, it's Fomaniac here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to reset any Android device. So here I got a Galaxy S6, it doesn't really matter what kind of phone you're using, I mean it depends uh, if you have, maybe you don't have a home button, maybe you just have a, a navigation bar, maybe you have the S9 or the S8, or you know, just any kind of Android phone. But yeah. Today I'm going to be showing you how to reset your phone. Let's say you have a password on it. Uh, this one's that this uh, Galaxy S6 doesn't actually have a password, but I want to reset it. So, yeah. All right. So what you want to do, you just want to boot it off or power it off. All right. Just like so. Just wait till it fully boots off. And now. Alright, if you're charging it, you don't have to unplug it, it's alright. Uh, but I'm charging mine since my one's nearly dead. I don't want it to die while it's, gonna, while it's gonna be resetting. So, if you have a phone with a navigation bar, all you have to press is your power button and your volume up key. And if, let's let's say you have one with a home button, then you just wanna press uh, the, uh, the powering, power button, the volume up key, and the home button. So I'm just going to do that. And then once you see the, once it uh, shows you the booting up logo, yeah, like that, just let it go. And now it should just go into recovery mode. So as you can see, it says installing system update on mine. I have no idea why, but uh, it should just go into recovery mode quick. See, it just does that. I have no idea. And then you're into your in your in recovery mode. So I have a lot of options. I have reboot system now and all that. Um, so you want to go scroll down. So these are this is to go down. You want to press the volume down button, the volume down key, and then to go up the volume up key, and then to accept you want to. Um, it depends if you have. Again, if you don't have, if you have a phone without a home button, you want to press the home button. No, you want to press this. But if you have a phone with a with, without a home button, then you want to press. Well, you want to press your home button. It depends. I honestly don't know. But yeah, you want to go to Wipe Data Factory Set. Uh, yeah, just press that. Yeah, you want to press the power button, and then you want to scroll down to wait. No, I think I did it wrong. Yeah, you want to go to wipe data factory reset. Oh yeah, I did it right. And you want to press yes. And now it should reset. Uh, it might take a while. I mean, it shouldn't take a while now. See, it just go back here. It's okay. So you want to press reboot system now. It works and on any phone. yeah, it works on any phone. Like you can see, the J5 too. But I'm gonna. Re I don't want to reset this. So, yep. So the S6. Here we go. It says wiping on all that. And then, see, it should just reboot. And now it might take a while. It actually might take a while for it to uh, reboot since it's getting resetted. Since, I mean, it got already resetted, but usually when you get a new Samsung phone or any kind of phone, it takes a while for it to boot up. So I'll be back when it fully boots up. All right, guys. So as you can see, um, here it is. By the way, if you might be wondering what that is, my friend is playing Fortnite right now. But yeah, here it is. It's fully resetted. As you can see, you're on your welcome screen or startup screen, whatever. But yeah, thank you guys for watching and see you guys in the next video. And yeah, please like and subscribe. And thank you guys for watching and see you guys in the next video. Peace out.